evening, everyone. It is the Tuesday, May 11th. It is now 7.13 and I figured I'd share with you guys my evening routine for after work. So if you're not familiar, I am a mom of three, but I'm also a first grade teacher, usually kindergarten teacher. I'm a first grade teacher this year. And um, because of COVID, my county introduced a program with which is called the evening academy so we do virtual teaching in the evening so i teach i start work at 1 30 i've got my planning time time for meetings things like that and then i teach from four to seven so at 7 p.m i am done teaching now this whole time that i'm teaching my kids are here three out of the five days a week two days a week they do have activities today just happens to be a tuesday so they do not have activities on the nights they do have activities they get here they get home around seven o'clock sometimes a little later if soccer runs late so um usually i have dinner prepped during the day i will prep it and that's something i can share in a separate video kind of like my morning afternoon routine um or if the kids are home, the big kids like to alternate cooking some nights, which is amazing to me. And it's great for them because it's a life skill. They kind of learn how to cook and stuff. So tonight, Junior <laughs> is making, what are you making? Chicken Alfredo, right? He is cooking chicken Alfredo. So he's about done. He's waiting for the vegetables to finish steaming. And then he's going to mix them in and we're going to have dinner. So like I said, it's about 7. 15 so we'll be having dinner around 7 20 ish and then um and i'll show you guys his chicken alfredo and then um i will show you guys what we do every night to make sure that the house is put together and that we are prepared for the next day and then if you guys are interested i can do that morning slash afternoon routine another day and share that with you as well and just so you guys know this will be mostly like vlog style um, because that's all I have the energy to do after working a full day and waking up early. So stay tuned for our evening routine. Okay. We're in the laundry room, which is a bit of a mess, but we're going to ignore that. Um, one thing I do every day is have, I have a laundry schedule. So everybody has a day where they do their laundry every week and this helps us to keep up with laundry um so for five days a week everybody has a day to do laundry and then on the weekend uh we do like sheets and you know mats from the bathroom and anything that's extra um if there's extra clothes that need to be washed things like that so today is my day to do laundry so i have a load that i put in this morning well it was more like this afternoon because i did do a costco run today so i'm gonna switch my laundry over and i I think I have a second load to do. Mine and my husband's clothes are bigger, so I have a second load to do. And then Kaylise had Vincent while I was working. They watched a movie, yes. She doesn't want to be shown, so. Okay, Vinny, go. So they are cleaning up their little movie mess. They were watching Monsters, Inc. while I worked. So I'm gonna switch laundry over. Like I said, this will be vlog style, so yeah. You guys don't really need to see me switching laundry over. I'm switching laundry over and putting a new load in to wash. And then Jinger is just about to serve dinner. The vegetables just finished. So we're gonna do that and it's 7.19. <laughs> I'm not struggling. Lyric, you can't play. This is Lyric's first walk. He's our puppy. He's only what, three months old? Four, maybe? No, not six yet. But the vet, the vet just cleared him to walk. Um, so Vinny wants to walk him, but he really just wants to be like with Melody. He doesn't know what to do. So we're gonna try this, um, see how it goes. And it's now, let's see, 7.53. Oh, 
Okay, we are home. It's now 8.23. We just finished watch, walking the dogs. That was Lyric's first ever walk. Like I said, the vet literally just cleared him to go on walks in the neighborhood. But he's just been going out back. The kids are having ice cream sandwiches and the dogs are having little doggy Ben and Jerry ice creams. I'm not having anything. I actually have heartburn. Um, so I'm about to go take like a Tom or something. And then we will start on chores. So I wanted to kind of excuse the licking in the background. Like I said, the dogs are having ice cream, first of all, but I'm, I wanted to kind of do like a explanation of how chores work. So each of the kids has a chore that they do for the whole week. Um, and then they switch the next week. So one of them does surfaces. That means all the, the coffee tables in the living room, um, the TV stand, just kind of like putting away any clutter there is there. Go wash your hands on your face, please. Go to the bathroom, wash your hands on your face. Bless you. Um, just making sure my desk doesn't have any trash or anything on it. The dining room table, they have to clear it off, wipe it down. And then the countertops, they clear everything from them and wipe them down in the kitchen. So that's their chore. Then the other person has floors. Um, that means picking up anything that doesn't belong on the floor, vacuuming, swiffering, um, wet and dry swiffering, all the floors, not the bedroom floors. And then they alternate cleaning the bathroom every day. So I'm pretty sure today is Junior's bathroom day. Yes, I have a So today Junior will clean the bathroom, their bathroom. They just wipe it down with like a disinfectant wipe swiffer it and that's it just like a quick cleanup just so that i have two boys so just so it doesn't smell um and then i handle dishes and anything else that needs to be done um usually i cook so i cook and i do the dishes today junior cooks so i'll do the dishes he has left i do take care of dishes in the morning as well so it kind of helps me out there but that's their chore. They do get an allowance. We use the green light card. I'll put a link in the description for like a, I think you get like $10 if you sign up using the link or something. Um, it's like a referral code. So I'll put that down there. It's like a debit card or credit card for kids and you can put money in. They can also have like a savings account on that card. They can invest, they can donate. It's pretty awesome. So I'll go ahead and put that down in the description box. But like I said, um they have green light cards so they get allowance every week for doing their chores so we do this every night i'm gonna try to get as much footage as i can but like i said everybody's kind of doing different things so i'll do what i can oh and vincent also has a chore vincent is responsible for cleaning up all the toys because there is so he cleans up all the toys and he also does his laundry on his laundry day which is tomorrow. Um, so he'll put in the washing machine. I'll put the soap in, he'll start it. He'll switch it over to the dryer. I'll start it um, and then I'll fold it for him and he'll put it away where it goes. So he does have chores, he's three. He also does help me load and unload the dishwasher sometimes, but he does make sure that all the toys are up off the floor and where they go and that he doesn't have anything thrown around which kind of helps the person that has to do floors and also the person that has to do surfaces if he has anything up on the surfaces. Um, so that's it. We're going to do chores. We always start chores around 8.30. It's 8.27, so we've got a few minutes. We'll start chores. We'll get the chores done, um, and then the kids will get showers, and we'll start winding down for bed.
bathed. <laughs> We're putting on our slippers. The big kids are supposed to be getting in the shower. Yes. Okay, it is 9.07 and Vincent is showered. Chores are done. Um, I didn't, I'm not running the dishwasher. I leave it open. I don't think I've mentioned in this video, my husband got a promotion. So he's working a different shift now. Um, so that's why he's not home. But uh, yeah, chores are done. I leave the dishwasher. He runs it after he eats his dinner, which I also leave out for him. And then um, bathed the baby. He took a shower, right? Uh -huh. I have to give him a little bit of medicine today because his sister gave him a little cold. So he's got like a runny nose, which is basically the only thing he has is a runny nose. He hasn't coughed or anything, but, or it could be allergies. I'm not sure, but, um, oh, he's been sneezing all day. Lyric. Um, but yeah, I'm going to give him a little bit of medicine before he goes to bed, but Every night, come here. Every night, while his brother and sister are showering, what do you get to do? I get to watch Blippi. He gets to watch Blippi, so he's gonna watch some Blippi now um, while he's waiting for his brother and sister to get out of the shower, and then we'll do bedtime routine. Okay, it is bedtime routine. Time first, I'm gonna give him a little bit of this dye-free cough and cold children's medicine. This just happens to be the nighttime one. That's all we have left over. It's not expired yet. So I'm gonna give him a little bit of this. Perfect, because he's about to go to bed. Then we will do teeth and books and prayers in bed. See how much it says I'm supposed to give you. Vinny is three years old. You get five milliliters, which is one teaspoon. There you go. Open big, there's some more in there. There you go. Okay. Now let's brush those teeth first. <coughs> Brush those teeth first. What's the teeth? What's the teeth for me? This is the toothpaste we use. Thank you. Here you go. All right, night on. Ah. Vinny bought shot glasses for the bathroom. We went to get the little Dixie cups at the Dollar Tree. They didn't have any more. Um, but he found these red ones and red's his favorite color. So he was super excited about them. Yes, they're mini solo cup shot glasses, but it is what it is. All right, let me floss. time we are working through this very old and very loved <laughs> three minute bedtime tales book that is from i think it was kaylee's second christmas junior's first christmas uh we got this for them like as a dual gift or whatever they were tiny so we're working through this yes you can take them off i'm going to sit here with vincent and read and then Sleepy time, right? Mm-hmm. Sleepy time. Prayers. Yes, prayers first. Why do you do prayers? Why do you do prayers? Why do we do prayers? Uh -huh, why? Because we're praying to God. Okay, we're gonna read Little Red Riding Hood. Once upon a time, I can sit closer. Oh. Oh. Is that your
Once upon a time, there was a little rabbit who always wore a bright red cloak with a hood. Her name was Little Red Riding Hood. One day, Little Red Riding Hood and her mother picked a, packed a basket full of good things to eat. They filled it with her grandmother's food. It's time to say your prayers. Oh, the flash is on. Time to, okay, turn off the light. It's time to say your prayers. Before these guys go to sleep, here's their room. Mostly cleaned up. There's a calculator over there on the floor and notebook next to Junior's desk, but okay it's mostly cleaned up laundry was put away we just got slippers over here by the bed that he's gonna put on in the morning so there's their room so messy here's Kaylee's room definitely needs to be vacuumed I don't know what's all over the carpet and there's a piece of wrapping paper randomly on the floor that means you didn't clean it up her desk is still messy but you get what you get until she didn't make her bed hopefully she makes it in the morning because I was in school. Um, but yes, her room's basically clean. So good night, Kelly's. is far from over. I'm gonna take about 20 to 30 minutes and work on YouTube stuff and then work on school work stuff and then go to bed. I try to go to bed by midnight. So we'll see how that goes today. <laughs> It is after midnight and I am finally going to go to bed. I got quite a bit of work done. Um, and sometimes when I get in the groove, I forget to cut myself off. So my husband's actually home now. Um, so I'm going to wash my face, brush my teeth, go to bed. If you're wondering, I'll show you what I use to wash my face. So to wash my face, I just use the CeraVe Hydrating Facial Cleanser. I use this morning and night, so I use that. Um, to hydrate, I use this Neutrogena Hydro Boost Water Gel, which does pretty good on its own. But I got this from Influencer. It's the Goop Beauty Goop Glow Lotion, and I've been using this along with this, and it's really good. And then I'm gonna brush my teeth, in case you're wondering. I use Sensodyne Pro Enamel because I have sensitive teeth. So I'm gonna do all of that and then I'm going to bed. <laughs> So face is clean, teeth are clean. Now I am going to I'm going to take off my jewelry.
and my hair I am going to put it up in like a pineapple bun I think it's called so just basically just get it all the way to the top of my head um, so that I'm not laying on it so that my curls don't flatten and lose their shape too much so I've had it in this clip um, but there's my curls after a full day so just gonna wear my hair tight. change into pajamas one second okay my pajamas nothing fancy it's a gray top and some pajama pants and now I'm gonna start my diffuser I did put the kids diffusers on tonight I did not show that um but since Kaylee's and Vinny have had a little bit of a cold I put some peppermint and tea tree oil in both rooms I don't know I just feel like that's good um, actually, it was yeah, spearmint and tea tree oil. I'm going to put spearmint and um, eucalyptus in mine because it's like a de-stressor. So I feel like it'll cool me down and I need that right now. And that's it. So my diffuser. six hours. Here it is. It's going. Turn off the lights and I'm going to bed. Good night guys.